Sometimes when you're on a diet, you just want to know that you can eat an unlimited amount of something. Well, there's comfort in it, at least for me. You guys, that is where veggies comes into play. Vegetables are highly encouraged on the Jenny Craig program and should be incorporated throughout your day, between your lunch and your dinner. It helps to keep things regular, if you know what I mean, and it helps to give your body all of the vitamins and nutrients it needs. Today, we are gonna be breaking down the Jenny Craig grocery guide, specifically the vegetable section. So, let's get started. In case you're wondering, all the information that I'm about to go over is in your Jenny Craig app. All you have to do is open up the app, look for the grocery guide, and go to the section where they're talking about the vegetables that you can have. You guys, you can print it and download it for your reference, well, download it and print it for your reference. That's what I like to do. That way you can keep it handy. Keep it in your notebook, your binder, weight loss journal, or even on your refrigerator so you know exactly what you can and cannot have. So, sometimes you just digest information better if someone else is feeding it to you. So, let's get into it. What about veggies? What can we have? What can't we have? What's all the hype about? I'm assuming that by now you and your consultant have taken the time to sit down and go over your menu. I want you to remember, your menu and my menu will likely not be the same. It all depends on our goals, how much we want to lose, how much we currently weigh, and our daily activity limits and our habits. So our menus will not be the same. But when it comes to vegetables, that's pretty same all across the board. Your consultant will show you your menu and show you exactly where, when, and how many vegetables you should be eating. But sometimes we kind of forget. And you know what? That's okay. That's why I'm here. Today, I'm gonna tell you the difference between a starchy and a non-starchy vegetable. Because on the Jenny Craig program, we can have unlimited vegetables as long as they're non-starchy. A non-starchy vegetable is something like spinach, your peppers, your cucumbers, your spinach, did I say that twice? Things like asparagus, you guys, things that are heavier in a water content, which are gonna be lower in calories, lower in carbohydrates. They're gonna keep your body flush because to be honest, Sometimes you will get constipated on this program. If you are on the Jenny Craig program and seem to battle with constipation, let me know down in the comments below. I could do a separate video on what I do to relieve constipation, but what I will say is eating veggies with a higher water content seem to help. And remember, those are unlimited. A starchy vegetable is something that's gonna be higher in calories and higher in carbohydrates. Things like your spaghetti squash, things like your sweet potato, things like your pumpkin, all good things, all good veggies, all good for you, but the ones that are gonna be higher in calorie and carbs, which are our starchy vegetables, are not gonna be good for your plan. They're gonna push you over your calorie limit and they're not gonna help you excrete the waste that you need to as fast as you need to. Does that make sense? So when you're eating a starchy vegetable, Jenny Craig does not put those under the unlimited category. It actually pushes those over into the category with fruit. That way you can measure out your serving size and you only wanna eat a limited amount of those. You guys, if you are planning on eating pumpkin or sweet potato this upcoming fall, which I, I love pumpkin, I'm, I'm, I'm gonna be eating some pumpkin. Let me know down in the comments below so that way I can show you guys a recipe for pumpkin spice lattes and a couple other pumpkin dishes that I've been putting together that are all Jenny Craig approved, but let's keep going. Y'all, there are so many ways to incorporate vegetables into your diet. It's not a one size fits all, and that's what I want you to remember. You can enjoy the veggies cooked, you can enjoy them canned. I showed you guys in my last video that I love some canned spinach. It doesn't have to be fancy, overpriced, organic, and in a bag. Just look at your nutrition labels, and if it meets the criteria that you're looking for, go with that. Cooked, canned, you can get them fresh, you can juice them, you can eat them raw. Whatever you can do to get yourself to eat more of these things because they're good for you. I know your parents told you this when you were younger, eat your veggies. You guys, that's one rule that we still need to follow today because it's good for your health, okay? Okay guys, here's an example of a 1200 calorie Jenny Craig menu for the Max Up plan. I am actually on the 1500 calorie plan, but as you can see, there'll be a call for a serving of vegetables at lunch. And if you go down to dinner, you will see that another vegetable serving is required there. On my personal menu, I get two servings at lunch and three more servings at dinner. So I am getting plenty of those non-starchy veggies to fill me up and keep me regular. So even with all that, you might still be wondering, exactly how much do I eat? I see that it's on my menu, but how much of these things do I have to eat? 
Well, that's all gonna depend on what you're eating. If you're eating raw veggies, that would be a one cup serving. If you're eating salad or leafy green vegetables, romaine, that would be a three cup serving. If you're eating cooked vegetables, that would be a half a cup serving. And if you are just handy dandy in the kitchen and fancy with the juicer and have a good recipe, you can juice your veggies, which will give you a four ounce serving. All this information is right there in your back pocket. Well, if you keep your phone in your back pocket, then it's right there. You guys, all of this information, remember, can be found in your Ginny Craig app. If you are having trouble with learning how to navigate the app, I would love to do a walkthrough for you. Let me know down in the comments below. You guys, you have all the tools you need to succeed. Download it, print it off, keep it somewhere safe, by your bed or in the kitchen, or put it wherever you put your coupons for when you go grocery shopping. Whatever that place is that you know you will be able to find it and use it as a quick reference when you're ready to get those veggies in during the day. Thank you guys for being here. If you are new here, seeing me for the first time, welcome to the channel. I am doing absolutely everything it takes to lose weight and feel great using the Jenny Craig program. If you have been here supporting for the past 14 weeks, I want to say thank you so much and welcome back. But until then, you guys, I won't ramble too much, but I will see you in my next video. Thank you so much. Bye.